Hi, Gary O'Toole here for SocioCaster and I'm really excited to announce that the SocioCaster client dashboard feature is now complete. In this week's video, I'm going to be giving you a quick orientation of the features and benefits in terms of use of the SocioCaster client dashboard and I'll also be giving you a quick tutorial on how you can actually use it with your clients yourself. Okay, so what are the benefits for SocioCaster users? Well, the SocioCaster client dashboard is perfect for digital agencies who provide social media management services. It's also ideal for individual consultants who provide social media management services. It provides your client with a tangible asset they can see and interact with. This immediately adds a lot of value to the services that you're already providing. You're also building authority in front of your client. You can moderate your team's content submissions via the dashboard. You can moderate your virtual team's content submissions via the dashboard. By moderation, we mean you can approve, reject, edit, or update any content as you see fit. Okay, so what are the benefits of the SocioCaster client dashboard for your clients? Well, your clients will be able to see all scheduled content. Your clients can approve content. Your clients can reject content. Your client can edit or update content. Your clients can see a helicopter view of all scheduled content in a calendar format. Your client can be actively involved and feel more involved in their social media marketing campaign. And your client can become more educated about what social media marketing actually involves and entails. Okay, so let's look at the main features of the client dashboard. You can brand the dashboard with your own logo. You can change the top and left bar colors to match your branding colors. You can use your own favicon. You can use your own custom welcome message. You can even use your own company subdomain to access the dashboard. You can give Facebook likes and make comments directly from the dashboard. And you can provide live statistics for the number of likes, comments and shares and interaction across all published content. Okay, terms of use. Uh, the SocioCaster client dashboard is only available to SocioCaster agency license holders. The client dashboard features are attached to the organization feature and can contain multiple social media accounts, multiple team members, in brackets, sub-users, and multiple access for clients login. Ideally, one organization is dedicated for one client only and can, can consist of multiple social media accounts which belong to that particular client. The current agency lifetime member has a limit of 10 organizations. If you re require extra organizations, they can be purchased at a fee of an additional $17 per client per month. Okay, here we are in your client dashboard. Just click on manage accounts, click organizations. This is where you enter the name of your client or organization. I've already created mine. And now just click here. You can add the social accounts to the organization. Just add the Facebook and Twitter demo accounts here. Add your sub users here, and this is where you add your client dashboard users. Just add the username, email, and password here. I've already created mine, and this is where you customize the dashboard. You upload the logo, which is 144 by 16 pixels here. Add your customized welcome message. Uh, set your colors for your top bar and sidebar in accordance with your branding. So you upload your favicon.
and this is the link to the client dashboard. You can customize this to be on subdomain. There's a separate tutorial for that in the bottom right hand corner. Just click where it says click here. Okay, we're just going to log into the dashboard with the details I've previously created for the account. And here we are inside the client dashboard. As you can see, I've got custom logo, custom favicon, and I've got my Facebook and Twitter account set up here. Okay, so this is the Twitter account. We can see the previously published content on Twitter. This is all the tweets I've done so far. And we can look at the stats and see what kind of interaction we've got. This is where you'd see the upcoming posts, none scheduled. These are just demo accounts. Again, back to published. Just a quick look at the calendar view. This is where you see all your previously published and upcoming posts in a calendar format. Okay, so here we are in the Facebook section. We're currently looking at the published posts. This is where your clients will be able to see the content you have previously published to their Facebook pages. Um, you can see how many likes or comments each piece of content has received. They're also able to like comments and add their own comments. Um, so this is in list view. So let's just look over to calendar view, which gives us the helicopter view that we spoke about in the orientation of this demonstration. Um, and you can see it's got a brief description of each piece of content. Uh, it tells you the time and date that it was published. Um, so let's take a look at the scheduled content view again in the helicopter view um, I've got a video scheduled to be posted at one o'clock today um, you can they're they're able to move around uh, to, to a more suitable time if they think that that time that you've posted it isn't isn't suitable um, and they're also able to reject it if they feel that that piece of content isn't suitable for their business um, and if they click on it they're also able to change the link photo and also add their own message in here if they wanted to personalize it a little bit further um, so that basically covers all of the basic features for the client dashboard um, it's exactly the same for LinkedIn and WordPress um, and I'll be back with some more detailed tutorials in each individual feature very, very soon. Hope you found this very useful, and I hope you're as excited as I am about this feature. Thanks for watching. I've been Gary O'Toole with Sociocaster, your number one multi-platform social media management tool. Hope you found this video useful, and I look forward to seeing you all again soon.